All right, now here we are with Mr. Shad Haller, who has accepted the position of police chief for our beautiful Sold Soldovia city. And he's been on the job for how long now, Shad? Uh, since October. Since October. Okay, well, do you want to tell people a little bit of history about yourself and how this job came into being for you? Sure, well, mostly everybody knows me. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a kid, local kid from Soldovia. Grew up here, met my wife here, graduated from here. Back in 93, I graduated in 88 and left for a while, got married, went in the military, came back in uh, 90 after the war, came back in 93 on my way to Korea. Uh, I haven't been home since then. And so, 2010, I think, come home and uh, give the kids experience uh, being in a small town. Everywhere we've been, which has been all over the, all over the United States, uh, we've never been really close to family. So it's an opportunity to come home and, and be part of family again. Now, obviously, being the police chief of a small town is pretty unique. What Was it a tough decision for you to make to take on this job? Um, you were filling some pretty big shoes there with Andy Anderson being in over 30 years in Soldovia. So. Yeah, and definitely some big shoes to, to fill. Um, yeah, it took me a little while to, to make the decision to actually do this. Um, I, uh, I've always been a guy who's wanted to step forward where the necessity was, where there was a need for, for stuff like this. Um, but again, like I said, it's big shoes to fill and a lot of commitment and a lot of time. And the main reason for me getting out of the military was to be able to spend more time with my family. Um, so coming home was a, was a big part of that. Um, but I, I also see that there's a need for it. So, um, and I can still get away with you know spending a lot of time with my family because it's my job revolves around being part of the community and being in the community and uh, our family is just that way. We, you know, Heading out now for training. Yeah, I leave actually uh, in six hours. Oh my. I'm in Sitka um, tomorrow morning at 11 and I take a PT test and then we start school. I'll be gone for 13 weeks. Um, I think there's a, a weekend in the middle in there around week seven that I get to come home for two days. Um, I don't know if I'm going to actually come home. Or I think if I stay at school long enough, I just in, in the scenario that I'm in, so it didn't break that out. Right. But um, yeah, so it'll be 13 weeks, and you know, it'll be good. So what what's the status of Soldovia while you're gone? Because you're the police chief, and so you do have a deputy who's also out of town. So. Uh, the 911 system is still active, so you, if you have an emergency, call 911. Uh, the troopers are on call for dispatch, uh, and they will get over here as quickly as means as possible. Right. Um, if it's not a 911 emergency, you can still contact the city manager, and he can whatever whatever needs to be done. Um, but again, if it's 911, if it's an emergency, dial 911, you'll get the troopers, uh, and that'll get that, that ball rolling. Okay. Well, one other thing I wanted to say, because Shad, you, when you first came to town, you were working with the kids, and I think you have a pretty great relationship. With I think the kids. that they have a real respect for you, and they like you, and I think that that's going to be really helpful to you. I know my daughter said that she was sad that you left that job working with the kids because she misses having you around. So. Well, it was fun, and I do enjoy it. I mean, that was a, a big thing because both my kids are teenagers. My, my two that are still home are teenagers, mm -hmm. uh, so that gave me a lot of time to spend with them. Even my youngest, right. who's 10, who come up and goes from me, and, you know, so it, would just, it was great to have my job be a part of the, my family so that they could be, so we can spend more time here. Yeah. Well, we appreciate you taking on this job. Like we said before, it's a hard, hard role to fill, and um, I think it's important that you have a, have a connection to the community, which you have, and I think you're going to be awesome. So thank you. Uh, <laughs> and thank you to your family, too, for letting you participate, because I know it's a 24-hour it's a commitment yeah. every day. So. Well, thank you. Thank you, Shad.